And then if we take that a step further, we're then looking at, well, if you're going into any of these relationship dynamics, then there is a healthy boundary and there is a healthy level of getting involved in these types of relationships without skewing the masculine feminine dynamic. But then we've also got the flip side, which is, well, hold on, how does your childhood trauma then feed in to that relationship dynamic? Because if you look at it from the sense of you have women going in with the father based projection of their partner, then the question is, how good a man was that father to them as the daughter? Because what you're going to get involved in is you're going to get the backlash or you're going to get everything that wasn't said from that dynamic thrust basically into your relationship. And then when it shows up in terms of that relationship, then you're technically having to deal with all of the unresolved trauma from that dynamic from childhood. And then when we start to expand this and open this up, there is a lot of protectiveness from the feminine side, whereas if they're masculine, which would have been their father at the time wasn't a strong protective role model and wasn't there providing that level of safety then it basically opens them up to be heavily guarded heavily restricted 